Hello, I'm Kasia Kozak, and welcome again to Kasia Dance World. Today, part two of your swing experience. We're going to be learning a little bit about point and changing of the direction. Yes? So, as we discussed in the previous class, we have the triple steps, triple step, triple step, and the rock steps. Yes, what we're going to introduce today are the points, right, that we can incorporate into our swing. So what we're going to do, point, step, point, step, point, step, point, step. Now what's the difference between a point and a step? Point means you are not putting your weight onto the foot, right? You can point it in any direction you would like, just a free, nice, small action. Step means transferring your weight. So I can have you, my steps when my feet are together. Could you see I'm transferring the steps? Or transferring the weight, I'm sorry. Or you can actually make the steps continuously keep on moving in a particular direction. So we can do point, step forward, point, step forward. Or I could go point, step side, point, step side, point, step side, point, step side. Or I can point and bring your feet together and transfer your weight, which we consider a step as well. Point, step, point, step, point, step. Right? So could you see the point just simply mean like finger. You're pointing with your finger, but you're not really going there. So you're just pointing with your foot and bringing your foot either towards you or try making the step in a direction that you would like to move to. Yes? So now... If we put a little bit of a sequence for you so you can practice, let's say for my girls, starting on the right side, you will go triple step, triple step, rock step. And then we're going to do your point. Point, 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 and finish with the rock step. Right? But you see it pretty simple. And especially if you don't have that much space, let's say if you're in your house and your living room might not be so big, bringing your feet together would be a really good idea. Now, for those of you, you can see like me, I have a little more space, you can actually make a step to the side. So we can go triple step, triple step, rock step, point step, point step, point step, point step, follow with the rock step, right? Pretty simple. Now, the same thing applies for my guys, right? You can actually practice this on your left hand side. You can practice on both sides, right? It would be nice for both parties to practice both ways, so therefore you develop both sides, right? So for my gentlemen, you can actually start to the left, to the right, then you have your rock step, and again, you do the points with closing your feet, Point, close, point, close, transfer your weight, point, close, transfer your weight, and then we do the rock step. And it's extremely important that you keep on transferring your weight. So when I transfer the, foot, the weight, my next leg is ready to go. Otherwise, if you're pointing, 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 could you see how you will kind of get stuck doing the same move over and over, right? So if we do this one more time, we're going to go triple step to your left triple step to the right then we're going to do the rock step and then we have a point now we can do the same thing as we did for the ladies you can point and step to the side point side point side point side point side and then rock step right could you see it pretty simple now i will turn around and i will try to do this together with you so you can actually follow yes let's start from the gentleman we're going to go triple step, triple step, rock step. Now we're going to do the point and step to the side. Point, side, point, side, point, side, point, side. Finish with your rock step. Rock step. Yes, now we'll try this to the other side, starting with the triple to your right. We go triple. Triple step, triple step, rock step, point, side, point, side, point, side, point, side, rock step. Right? So could you see again? Pretty simple. Just be patient, right? Just getting used to that action. 
action. Let me actually show you sideways. Point, change your weight. 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 Point. Right? The one nice, fun thing about it is when you're pointing, I would like your body to rotate towards the leg that you are pointing with. Not away, but towards it. So almost like if I'm pointing with my right foot, I would like my left foot almost go across that leg. And then we're going to step to the side and we're going to rotate the body in that direction. And then again, point, step, point, step, point, step, point. Right? So could you see when you're actually using your upper body in a contrabalance way, it kind of gives you much more stability, right? If you're rotating in the direction that your foot goes, could you see it's going to create a little bit of a discomfort. So make sure that you get used to, let's say, moving your right foot across and your left arm across. Across and across and across and across. Let's do this together, right? We're going to go pointing with your right and right leg and left hand here and here and here and here and here and here now you can do the same thing when your feet are closed right here together point together point together point together right again very simple try to make try to be very patient now what's nice if we do this side by side, so my ladies are going to the right, my gentlemen are going to the left, and then as the two of us, we can on your point, progress forward. So just imagine I have a partner, we both do the triple opposite direction, he goes left, I go right, triple step, triple step. We both do the rock step, rock step. And now both parties are pointing, right? So it's almost gonna feel like we're pointing towards one another, and then step into the sides, and then we can look at one another. And point, then step and look away. Point, and step and look at each other. Point, step, look away. Practice one more time. Point, look at each other. Point, look away. Point, look at each other. Point, look away. Right? It could be a fun little practice, and then we both finish with the rock step. And then you can start again, or what would be nice, yes, if we add a little bit of a rotation, changing places, right? So after your last point, point and step, when we do a rock step, rock step, instead of doing triple here, I'm going to chain, turn, the quarter of a turn, and then I'm facing a different wall. So now when I go triple step, I'm facing different wall. So now when I'm pointing, could you see how I'm going towards different direction, right? And then I do the rock step, rock step. And again, now I have a choice going the same way or turning court over turn, facing a completely different direction. And when we do, and we do the same thing, triple, rock step, point, 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 and rock step. Right? Could you see? Pretty simple, pretty easy to follow. Yes? You can add the change of the, uh, change of the direction. You don't have to in the beginning. The easiest way to do this will be to face one wall, do your whole sequence, and then when you're doing the rock step after the point, you're just facing different walls. So you're marking that every beginning right, of your sequence is going to be facing different direction. So therefore, it's easier to keep where you are in the room. Otherwise, sometimes things could get a little bit confusing. Of course, later on, later on, once you get a little bit more advanced, you could do half a turn, you could do a quarter turn. I could be facing you, right, doing my point. And then I could decide my second set it's going to be, instead of a quarter of a turn, half a turn. So I'm going to be backing you. I'm going to do the rock step and I'm going to rock it greatly. And now I'm dancing my whole sequence in an opposite direction than what I just have done. Right? Could you see I do this? I do the rock step and I come back 
right at you. Right? So could you see, in a way, you could then play with it how much and how little you can rotate. it. Enjoy your points. Enjoy your rotation. I'm Kasia Kozak. Thank you so much for visiting me. See you next time.